To install a Coro Protec powered anode rod, turn off the water going to the water heater. Turn off the gas or electric to the water heater. Open the hot side of a faucet and keep it open. Drain a couple of gallons of water from the tank so the water level is just below the top of the tank. Use a 1 and 1 16th inch socket and unscrew the old anode rod. Turn it counterclockwise. If it doesn't turn easily, slide a metal pipe over the socket handle for more leverage, or you can use an impact driver. Have someone hold the tank if it moves while unscrewing the anode rod. Lift out the old anode rod. Wrap plumber's PTFE tape around the male threads of the powered anode rod three to five times clockwise. Insert the powered anode rod into the opening and turn clockwise until snug, then use a 31 mm or a 1 and 3 16 inch socket to tighten it down. The top will be higher than the old anode rod. Install the grounding wire with the ring terminal to one of the tank cover screws. Insert the spade connector onto the metal tab on the anode rod. Crimp it in place with pliers. Turn on the water to the tank and wait until the water is flowing out of the hot side of your open faucet to be sure all the air is out of the tank. Then turn off the faucet. Turn on the gas or electric to the tank. Plug in the power cord to a standard outlet. 